Muslims seeing visions and dreams is so common that I'm no longer shocked when it happens. Why is it so common? Maybe because they have the faith. Maybe they expect that God will speak to them through visions and dreams. But one thing is for sure, God is gracious. And by his sovereignty and grace, he is appearing to many, many Muslims personally to invite them to his kingdom. You see Muslims in bondage of this theology of darkness. And many of them, they need something like that. So they will make a decision for Christ. I never forget one day when I was on the air, this lady called. Her name was Roya. And right up front, she said, Pastor Hormoz, do you interpret dreams? I never claimed that I would do it. I'm not a Joseph. But I said, well, uh, share your dream. Maybe I can help you. And this is what she shared. She said, I'm a devout Muslim. I pray several times a day. I fast during the month of Ramadan. But the last few months after my night prayer, I have been watching your programs. And the more I watch, the more I get confused. I'm saying, God, which way is the way? Is Islam the way or the way of Jesus? And I can't find the answer. Last week at night, after I watched the program, I prayed the same. God, help me. I'm confused. Help me find a way. And I went to bed and I saw this dream. I was lost in a dark desert. And I was crying out to God, show me the way I'm lost. And then suddenly an angel of light appeared to me. I said, please help me, please help me. And the angel said nothing and just pointed to a direction. And I looked there and I saw the cross of Jesus. I ran to the cross and at the foot of the cross, the light fell on me and I felt so much peace and joy. Now, Pastor Hormoz, would you tell me the meaning of that dream? You see, suddenly I became an expert dream interpreter because it wasn't hard. I told her, that's easy. You ask Jesus, you ask God to show you the way and he did during your dream. Jesus is the way. Now, are you ready to receive Christ? Of course she was. So I prayed with her. And as she prayed, she said, I'm so full of God. I feel so much peace and joy. I feel a new life. And then she said, thank you, thank you. Thank you, Pastor Ormos. Thank you, Irwan Alive. Thank you for helping me to find the true God. May I pass on that thankfulness to you? It's because of our partnership that people like Roya, who are sincere Muslims, are coming to Christ. If you don't do your part, we cannot do our part. And I appreciate you prayerfully consider supporting Irvana Life. The next couple of months until Christmas, we are running a matching gift campaign. May I ask you to participate? Either give and challenge others to give or just respond as God leads you. Together, we can make a difference. Would you go to our website? Or easier is to just text the word Iran, I-R-A-N, to 74784. Once you do that, you get several links, some testimonies and also a link for donation. I really appreciate you. Together, we are making a difference. Let's continue. There are millions of royas. You know, not all Muslims are terrorists or even fanatic. There are millions of Muslims sincerely looking for true God. Let's just give them a chance to hear the gospel and respond to it. God bless you.